Liz on Flatbush Avenue just across the street from the Barclay Center is the borough's very first medical marijuana dispensary. Sativa Medical sells cannabis oil, which can be used in things like vaporizer pens and capsules. Employee Colleen Hughes, who is also a patient, says medical marijuana has helped her manage pain she was treating with opioids. Medical cannabis can actually help people um, bridge the gap between being bedridden and actually getting up and being able to wash your hands or do menial tasks. But not everyone agrees. For years, Monsignor Joseph Nugent has worked to help recovering addicts. He says pot is a gateway drug. It's ridiculous that you're using uh, a substance that causes disease addiction to ease the pain of other disease. It just doesn't make any sense to me at all. Bishop of Brooklyn Nicholas DiMarzio agrees in an interview with Currents News last June. He talked about the dangers of pot, but he did mention a potential benefit. It's a gateway drug leads to further drug abuse. That's notwithstanding the medical benefits where, you know, people have arm the chemotherapy or something very strictly regulated. It can be helpful to them. Dr. Blanca Vasquez says CBD, a component of the plant, has changed the way epilepsy is treated, but patients using medical marijuana should remain under the care of their doctor. They should have a great partnership with the doctor. It really is something that your doctor should be clear. What are the indications for the medical marijuana use? Because a lot of these products are not FDA approved. If you or anyone you know is suffering from an addiction, Monsignor Nugent suggests reaching out to your local Catholic charities for a referral, or you can reach out to his parish of St. Paul and St. Agnes. In Park Slope, Emily Drewby, Currents News.